Amanda Bees. How are you? I'm back. Ah, <laughs> oh, wow. What a week. What a week. Oh, I don't ever want to do that again. <laughs> um, first off, I want to say thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to all of you that have reached out to me and George. Um, it means the world. You know that. And you know I love you. For all of the new people that came from Jennifer's channel, um, or if you just came from the YouTube streets, <laughs> uh, welcome, welcome. Um, I'm sorry that the last video that you clicked on was not a very good one. <laughs> um, I did have to go for surgery and it all went kablooey. But um, <laughs> now I'm back and I'm feeling so much better. And we'll get back to getting, doing what we do, right? Um, so if you are new, I would love it if you would maybe click the subscribe button, maybe a like, comment, say hello. <laughs> um, and that would be wonderful. I wanted to try and do this before George got back from um, doing his jobs. Today is football Sunday. So you know how that goes, right? Lots of loudness. <laughs> so... But George lost his um, Roku remote and I ordered some. They came. They were the wrong remotes. I didn't know there was a Roku TV. Uh, I thought it was just the box. So I just went and ordered some Roku remotes. It was for the TV. So I have to send them back. I've got other ones coming, but they won't be here till tomorrow. So he can't use the TV. So he's got to watch football on his computer and he's not very happy. So today's going to be a day where I have my headphones on and I'm just doing my own thing. I'm crocheting again. I'm so happy. Uh, although I do still have a little bit of a headache. I do have medication. Um, Cymbalta? Celebrex. Cymbalta. Cymbalta, I think it is. <laughs> um, so... Yeah, so they gave that to me for my headaches, and lo and behold, that fixes my arthritis as well. So it's a win-win. Uh, but uh, my nausea is now gone. Thank God. Oh, you know, I didn't eat for four days, and I never lost a bloody pound. Can you believe that? Unbelievable. So, um, yeah, so now I'm just eating, eating, eating. <laughs> so, um but that's okay. I need to. Uh, so last night I made some soup. Um, like I homemade kind of soup. Um, I kind of cheated. I, I did the chicken broth boxes that you can get, but then I made, I put in some bacon and some hamburger. Uh, I cut up a steak really fine, put that in and some pork, um, stuff and some potatoes and sauerkraut and I I cooked that up and I'm hoping that that's gonna help me get the stuff going in my digestive system so far so good <laughs> so, um, but yeah so I my headache I just got a little mm, right here you know so I'm gonna try really hard today not to take any meds I've been daked oh you guys I was suffering so bad. My head felt like it was coming off my shoulders. Um, the pain was so intense. And George said, Sandy, you've got the medication. Just take it. And I couldn't do it. I, I couldn't. I mm. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. <clears throat> I couldn't do it. I could not put that medication in my mouth. I was absolutely terrified that I was going to have another allergic reaction. I had my EpiPen with me right there. Um, and George ended up just stopping work. And he, he said, I'm not going anywhere. He says, you need me. Um, and he says, you need to take this medication. You can't keep going like this. And I'm going to sit here with you while you take this medication. And he did. He... You know, it took me about 10 minutes for me to even get it to my mouth. 
Um, and then I finally, I took it, I handed it up and said, okay, you guys take over. And I curled up in a fetal position in George's arms and cried and cried and cried. And he cried with me. <clears throat> and I was okay. Um, I took a gravel with it. I took some food with it. And we just sat. We just sat for like a half an hour while I sat there and cried and waited to see if this was going to be a good outcome or a bad one. And he didn't let me go. I love that man. <laughs> okay. So, um, my headache went away right away. Uh, my nausea went away because I had the gravel in me. And I took a deep breath and went, okay. This is a good thing. Um, so, for the last two days, I've been taking the Cymbalta uh, twice a day and my headaches at a dull roar now so I don't even know what time it is I think it's like nine o'clock in the morning I haven't taken anything and I'm gonna try really hard not to I have an appointment tomorrow morning with the chiropractor to get my neck fixed to see if that helps as well and um, onward and upward so it's a hurry up and wait. We just got to wait to see when I get this appointment with these specialists. And yeah, so I'm going to just put all that out of my mind and I'm going to focus on getting stuff done. So I picked up my crochet hook yesterday because I didn't have a headache. It was great. <laughs> and I decided to just do something small, mindless, whatever. So of course, me being me, I had to pick the feather stitch. Why? <laughs> um, and so I started making a purse, which is something I haven't done in a long time. So what I did was I made a rectangle. Oops, I gotta cut that off. So I made a rectangle and oops um and then i folded it halfway and then i folded the other half over top to make a latch or a uh what do you call it yeah that thing um hang on so yeah so it's like this and then i put one of these latch things on it that slide in here and i oh that on and then I put these what are these called carabiners no these are are they no I don't know what these are called so I put these on on either side now all I have to do is make the um, strap but it kind of gives me Beetlejuice vibes <laughs> so I gotta do the strap and then I'm gonna hang them on there and then I have a um, a moon with the crescent moons on the sides that I'm going to be making, and I'm going to put that on the back. So, yeah, I might put it on the front. I don't know. We'll see because it's really busy looking already. So, <coughs> um, we'll see how it goes. So, yeah. So that's what I made. Uh, I might try and get somebody to line it for me. I don't know. It's pretty thick. <clears throat> the feather stitch is really thick. So, and then I didn't know this, but I've got a program called Creative Fabrica, and that's where I get a lot of my graphics for doing <clears throat> my mugs and tumblers and all that kind of stuff. And I was looking through it. I was looking for... I'm starting to do the graphics for the other bags that I'm making. And I found out that Creative Fabrica 
actually has <clears throat> free patterns. I was like, what? Oh, wow. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. I didn't bring my coffee in here. <clears throat> and so I was looking through and I picked out a few little patterns because what I want to do is mystery boxes and have little things in there. <laughs> and then I saw these little guys and I was like, oh, I got to make these. <laughs> So I've only made one so far. <clears throat> Halfway through the second one, um, it was like 1.30 in the morning last night. And I was like, I can't, mm -mm, I can't do this. <laughs> I got to go to bed. So, because I'm not sleeping well. So, oh, <laughs> do you see this little guy? Little Octo. And I did do the eyes. I got uh, 12 millimeter eyes. I got some new um, new stuff that I was using on them. I wish you could see it better. But it's like really sparkly. I wonder if I can... Whoa, whoa, hello. <clears throat> oh. oh, look at that. You can see me now. <laughs> can you see me now? Hang on, let me turn it down a little bit. Oh, whoop, that's too much. Oh, no, that's not the right one. See if I can. Let's. Oh, come on. Oh. No. Here we go. Can you see that? Anyway. Um. So yeah. <coughs> Put this up. Back where it belongs. Um, so yeah, I, I'm starting to make these little guys, and I, I'm not sure if I'm going to make them into keychains or what I'm going to do yet. But they're cute. They're really cute. Uh, and I did these before I went into the hospital. But I made little chicken nuggets, <laughs> and I am I'm going to put the keychain things on these. So. Yeah. So there. Oh my goodness. There. Now I look like white as a ghost. Uh. Oh, these turn. Do these turn? Oh, these turn. I didn't know that. Oh. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> the little things, I tell you. Um, I'm going to try and finish the tutorial that I was working on before I went in the hospital. All I have to do is the collar now. But, yeah, I had a little bit of a mishap. I think I told you guys about it already. Where I accidentally flipped the one panel the wrong way. So, um, I have to deal with that. I have to... Uh, explain that in the video and then I can get the video out and what else not much else guys I just wanted to touch base with you and uh, tell you guys I'm okay and um, oh I wanted to also say thank you to Jennifer cinnamon stitches she contacted me and it took me a little bit to get back to her um, but I did uh, and she <laughs> She messaged me twice going, are you okay? Are you okay? What's happening? Are you okay? <laughs> oh my God. I love that woman. Um, <clears throat> she, she was really worried about me as were a lot of you, most of you, all of you. Uh, I was worried too. Let me tell you. <clears throat> um, so we'll just hand it up and, um, just move on. Okay, uh, so yeah, I, I, I'm going to try and get some bags done today. I want to print off the graphics that I've done. And I did get the um, decals that I had made that I was telling you guys about. The one that I really wanted to put on, the one that said, I'm, um, I don't sugarcoat shit, I'm, I'm not Willy Wonka. 
they came out like massive and I was like oh I must have hit the wrong size so <clears throat> they're even too <coughs> excuse me <clears throat> they're even too big to be on a t-shirt so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with them I might have to put them on a sign or something I've never done that before so, but the other ones um, did come out. Actually, do you want to see them? I'll be right back. Okay. So, now I'm looking at them. I think they're all kind of big. I don't know. Let's see how it goes. Okay, here's, so here's the Willy Wonka one. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's too big to be putting on a t-shirt unless it's like a 2x t-shirt 3x t-shirt but um yeah so i'll have to figure that one out figure out when i'm gonna put that on and then i did this one oh, if you can see that it says be naughty save santa the trip <laughs> but the the um the bow is really cute. It's a little fluffy. So, um, and then I've got this one. I'm in my Grinch era. So that's me. Uh, whoops. Oh, there we go. So, and the ball's all fluffy. So, yeah, so I think these are, I don't know. That one might, that one will work. So, so that one would, yeah, that one won't work. This one, yeah, it might work too. But the, the other one definitely is too big. This, these ones, I think I'm gonna have to size them down a bit, a little bit. Um, and I'm probably not gonna get them out in time for Christmas this year. So, which sucks. But um, I'm still going to make them up anyway, and then I'll just keep them for next season. Well, George is home. So anyway, okay, guys, I just I just wanted to touch base. Hey, dear. Want to say hello? Hello. I meant to them. Hello. <laughs> so anyway. Okay, I'm gonna go because now it's gonna get loud and uh, I will talk to you guys soon. Okay, I love you all. Bye.